today I have something very very exciting to do. I I just after getting this I knew I had to do uh, I had to show you this because this is something really really great and and so special. I just got the box for Super Smash Ultimate in the limited edition. It's it's amazing. This big box is such an amazing box. You you know it's it's designed in a great way. You 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 see all the characters in front and and the back and yeah, it's it's very it's it's amazing and it should contain the the game the, co the GameCube controller and uh, an adapter for the controller. Yeah, Lo let's let's look what's inside there. Let's let's first open it. And I really love the way it's it's opening. It's uh, it's like a it's like a small case and. All, all your characters are in there and look there's the game uh, directly up front it's it's really it's, it looks really fantastic when you open it so let's let's take a look what's uh, what's inside the game case yeah it's your it's your standard it's your standard game uh, a switch ca game case and yeah there's everything you can you can you can imagine there's the, the game and the cartridge and warning labels in French I think but that's no problem because we all know French it's it's really amazing and let's what's what's sti what's what's still underneath there's so much more in this big box yeah so there's the game and it's it, it's it comes in this big great cardboard case so it looks looks more no, more elegant in any ways and yeah we have the we have the, con the adapter and the controller underneath it in their original packaging. That's fantastic. Yeah, let's let's take a look at the at the uh, port and at the multiplayer port. Yeah, it's for Nintendo Switch and even Wii U. You can use it. That's amazing. Let's let's look inside. What's what's in there? Yeah. Oh yeah. That's just some yeah some some warning labels and there is the adapter. Yeah, you need for two two USBs and the adapters themselves, very high quality adapters, fantastic. And let's let's take a look at the controller. Yeah, um, how it's, it's 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 a standard GameCube controller just with the Super Smash logo on it. It's oh, I can't can't wait. And this is also for it's you can use it for the Switch, for Wii U, for Wii, and even the the old GameCube. It's it's great. Let's let's take a look inside. Yeah. You know that's oh, a bit of the plastic here and there. Yeah, it's, it's still the same. Yeah, it's it's your standard. It's your standard and amazing, amazing looking GameCube controller. And this this whole yeah, it's, it it really feels it really feels good and it, it's it makes it so special with the with the uh, Super Smash logo on there. You can see it's it's very fine crafted and detailed. And yeah, it's it's you can just plug it in and 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 play with it. I it's 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 really really amazing. So yeah, there's there's nothing more. It's just, it's it's just your your, your the, that was everything in it. So yeah, I, what do I need more? I I I think I will get go play this game now. It's 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 amazing to see so much care from Nintendo taking for their limited editions. It's 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 just amazing. So yeah, um, go get it. It's 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 the best thing you can get at the moment. So yeah, it's it's worth it. It was worth the ninety nine euro I paid for it. So uh, yeah, I, I will go play this one now. Thanks for watching and goodbye. I'm real uh, for real this time. Um, yeah, sorry for that little crazy intro bit, um, but this was something I I just had to do for for different for so, or for for many reasons I um, I had just in mind. It's, I'm I'm really sorry for that uh, for freaking some people out how bad that was, but um, yeah, I just yesterday I got this um, the the limited edition of uh, Super Smash Brothers and. I'm a big fan of this game. I'm not good at it, but I really love playing it, especially with other people. And um, I really was looking forward when it came out. And after I read that the uh, that there will be another limited edition with the GameCube controller and the uh, port for it, I wanted to get it because last time for the Wii I missed it, and it was very hard at the time to get. Uh, the the connector for the GameCube controllers um, for a decent price. Let's put it this way: um, the normal Nintendo uh, limiting shortage. Uh, to be honest, it's uh, something I really hate um, 
I really hate what Nintendo is doing there. But that's not point of this video. Now, after getting the, uh, getting this package, um, the first thing I really uh, let's let's do it this way. I, I will start how I felt through um, through the whole ordeal after getting this package. So. You you have a f so you, you have uh, a feeling where I'm coming from when I'm uh, <laughs> or why I did this little intro bit. Now, when I got this package, um, I'm honest. The package is really is, is really beautiful. Uh, even if the H uh, signs down there, but uh, can be a little bit. Uh, yeah, they they don't look that good, but. I can overlook them because I really like that. Um, I, I really like the design. I have a really plain uh, black package, but with the w w just with the logo and all the characters just in one stripe. It's it's really looking good. This is one of the packages I would put um, on display somewhere on uh, on the top of the shelf where you normally don't go. Like there are o only a few I would would put there, but this is really one of them. Um, it's it's really um, it's really an, uh, a a nice design a very elegant design not overused not not anything it it captures your eye in so many ways um, they really did, did everything the the back okay you can you don't see it normally but also I really enjoy not 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 much is uh, is there a, a few screenshots and I like the the roster of all the characters in there it's like I said the design from if you if if you see this this design first time it's it's really in, it's really not that bad. Um, the second thing I really enjoyed is opening the box. It's um, not your, your standard; it's a two-part box. It's uh, hinged, and um, the first thing you see is uh, in the top. Again, all the characters put there, and um, this is I, I quite like this um, this this uh, idea. And then the part is where I felt a little bit down for many reasons. Now. The first thing, like I said in, in, in the intro bit, this box cost me nearly 100 euro, um, a little bit over uh, 100 dollars, and um, yeah, if you open it and, like I said, the first thing you see is the top of, of, um, of it, but then your eyes fall on the game itself. It's just it's just the normal packaging of the game um, put in some cardboard with just the, your Super Smash logo and uh, beside. But the cardboard, you have, you know, the the point is you have this gloss all over the the packaging outside, and here it just looks like plain old cardboard, um, cheap cardboard to be exact, and. You put the game out, and yeah, you have nothing more in there. It's it's just it's it's just sad seeing this. And um, if if you look closer, like I said, um, you can see all all the points where it's where it's slowly uh, disintegrating, where where it's a little bit. It it it's it's really bad cardboard. It's it's really it really looks sorry. And the next thing I really um, saw was after putting this part out of it, they just put in there the normal packaging of the extras from the adapter and the controller. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying <laughs> I'm not saying that these things are bad per se, but you're paying for a limited edition, and the only thing limited on this, and even that, I'm really question is the overall package because i believe if i haven't checked it at the moment to be honest but i believe if i bought all these parts separate maybe a little bit cheaper i'm not 100 percent sure but it could be um this is something something i have seen a lot lately um it sometimes you have the feeling that someone who uh, that the designers of the Outside of some of the boxes, um, had more time, or were at at some point were let go, so they never could finish the inside of the boxes, or it's just yeah, we needed a box, we had this uh, this box uh, lying around. Maybe we wanted to do a, a box uh, with, uh, or we wanted to do something where the console was uh, included because, interestingly, this box is nearly as big as the the Switch box itself when you buy it, and. I have the feeling they just had them over in some way, or 
didn't do it with the game or doesn't, uh, didn't want to do a bundle and just put the rest in there and this is some this is something like i said i see a lot uh, don't get me wrong i'm not saying that uh, i wanted something big inside or some or some some other things in there but please there there sh there, there there should have been some other things um, you, you can do it. So pu don't put the, your your standard cardboard boxes from the controller or something like that. Just if you can, if you um, if you open up the box to to something like two slabs or some uh, uh, or something like that. You can just open uh, two flaps. You open it's 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 already looking interesting. There is a system I know um, from I think um, where did I see it. It was it was a hardware uh, producer. I know that. Um, if you put out the uh, system that was on top, you had two flaps underneath, and when you opened them, the whole the whole cardboard it was only cardboard just came up with it. And I think this is this uh, this would have been an opportunity to some to do something like that. Just do something very special. So open uh, when you, if you open it, just do some 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 something over it a little overlay you can also just put aside and um, yeah you see the controller and the adapter port and not just the plain or plastic or cardboard and just to get it straight um, I just put if you put it pull it out of its uh, uh, of its place and that's another sad part it's you just see you just see the plain white cardboard <laughs> underneath. So yeah, uh, you you're paying. Uh, really, this is just another. This is just a carry a carrying thing, uh, a, a carrying box for. Yeah, the con for, for all the, the three items you can get. Um, it's it's very sad to see it, and um, I know a lot of people will say, "Yeah, but what are you, what are you telling me? It's not so interesting. We are interested in what's in it from what it contains." And yeah, but I personally think if you buy something like that, a special edition or something, then also for me at least, maybe I'm I'm an, I'm, I'm belong to a uh, dying species in this case, but make it fun to open it, make it interesting to open it. It's um, don't don't make it don't make it something. Yeah, okay, I buy it and then throw it away. I I, I buy a limited edition for a reason. And not to, uh, yeah, not to just have it as a carrying box. Um, maybe I can can show you something. What I what I mean when I when I say make it a little bit special. I'm just checking if I have the box here. Uh, one moment. Oh, there up there is it. Um, I can't show you everything about this one, but uh, I think now. This is something a little bit different, so uh, don't go uh, <laughs> at my throat saying, "Yeah, you can't compare compare it." Now, this is the soundtrack from the uh, from the Fate series, or specific from Fate uh, Extra CC. Um, now, this is just there's just CDs in there, but this box is done in a very interesting way now we y y you can see it's it's already designed in a very interesting way from from the outside like i said like the super smash p uh, um, box now i open this one again it's the same it's the same system you, it's, it's one piece so and now we have the interesting part um you see they all they they, they have put in these um these flap kind overlays and there are also designed. I know it's a little bit. M maybe it's 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 not a cheap a cheap m uh, thing to do. And yeah, I can't go any further in this case. Uh, or let's put it this way: I put the main page a little bit uh, to uh, to side because uh, I get problems uh, in that. So and then we have again we have a picture, a little bit different picture from the box itself. Then we have a small booklet. Oops, it's a little bit hard to open with one hand. So let's see what we have underneath there. And again, we have an in we have a booklet. Again, I can't show you the main uh, picture for different reasons. And then we have the CDs underneath it. And yeah, and still then there is. Some I, I I I I don't put it all with, and still there is cardboard underneath it. But the way it's designed, 
the way the colors are chosen for the in inside of the box, it doesn't look cheap if you know what I if you get my drift in this case. So, and we are talking and, and now I know a lot of people say yeah, um, but we are talking about big companies and so, and that's the that's the problem. Nintendo is a big company, and if I look at some of the limited editions I had in the past uh, few two two or three years, I got from. Um, from Nintendo games, they were all really, really bad. And if some, let's put it this way, indie developers can make big, interesting boxes, and even some Kickstarter projects um, can make interesting designed boxes. And um, I had one here uh, a few days ago, don't know where it is at the moment, then you're doing something wrong. I, again, I know it's just my personal opinion, but like I said, for me, I think opening a box, uh, especially a limited edition, should also be something special. Um, or you should feel like you have something special in your hand, not just, um, yeah, not like I said, not just carrying a carrying box. Because if I wanted a carrying box, I just ordered all three items um, at my local store and just yeah got them uh, shipped here so um it's the same it's it's a nice like i said it's a very nice looking box but paying or let's let's put it this way as a limited edition this is very very dissatisfying let's put it this way it's really sad seeing something like that but um it's it's not like i said it's not only nintendo it's just i just had to talk about this because nintendo was the last uh, last company that had done this it's just, it's it's everywhere now, and uh, I, f I just feel it's 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 like I said, it, I, it feels sad n uh, knowing that um, opening a box became something, yeah, something to forget. To be honest, um, I really love opening boxes in so many ways, uh, especially when I bought something new, and making it that sad is. Um, yeah, it's it's really it's really making me sad in so many ways. Uh, yes, sorry for talking about uh, or reviewing a box <laughs> in this uh, this case, but I just had to get this um, off my mind and so uh, because I th I really think this should um, the art of of uh, making limited editions uh, or special editions or something like these uh, special boxes should come back because it's always fun opening them and it should become f again f fun again to uh, opening them and not only doing something to just to, to be seen as a package yeah it should become something special again in so many ways so thanks for watching uh, and see you next time bye